<laughs> I've dressed up for the occasion. Is that one of your children in need suits? <laughs> no, I feel, I feel like I've um, I feel like I've worn it before for yeah. this. I don't know who it is. St it's still knocking around in the office, so I thought. Um, okay. I like that basically what you both do is just mind sweep whatever clothes you can find in the office, and here we are. Yeah. Chris has got legs of pig and body of live lounge. Live well, lounge He's got a live lounge tee on, yeah. And, um, and a Dua Lipa promotional that's hoodie. Like a loincloth, I'm using it. What's an absolute state. Instead of pants. Does the loincloth go all the way around underneath? I don't know, I've no. just wrapped it around. And Greg wearing a suit. So it's if that's something like, that might uh, float to your boat, uh, then get onto the Radio 1 website now. It's sort of like sort of Vernon K circa 2009 suit. Family fortunes. Family fortunes. Yeah. Shiny showbiz. Shiny, shiny, shiny. It's time to witness the wetness. This is Innuendo Bingo. If you can, put your phone on and give us a watch today. It's always better when you watch. Adds another dimension. Greg James on Innuendo Bingo starting now. You are one of my favourite players of this game, you know that. Thank you, it's an honour to be back. Firstly, if you could take your waters in your mouths, lads, we're going to the Formula One on BBC Five Live. And Lewis Hamilton has just won the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. And it sounds like his mum couldn't be happier for him. So Lewis Hamilton sprays the champ, well... We're in uh, the United Arab Emirates. He sprays the, the, the fizzy rose water over the uh, crowd down below. And uh, Lewis Hamilton's mother here as well. And I think uh, she got a little bit damp from that celebration. <laughs> She's very excited. That's her son up there. Uh, she got a little bit damp from that celebration. Mm. We both thought we held there. Yeah. We yeah, held. That's very good, actually. Well done. Well held. <laughs> well held. Rose water. Party time. <laughs> Party time in Dubai. It's because you're in the UAE, isn't it? Yeah. I got a flight there once and I saw the drinks trolley coming down. I was like, yes. No, nope, it was um, uh, it was rose water. <laughs> in a wine bottle. I'll just Imagine how disappointing that was for me. Uh -huh. They could have sprayed anything, though, couldn't they? Mm. Would have been... Yeah, I mean, just think of the other options. A couple of cans of lilt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah lad. Now let's go over to BBC Two. And it's the Rugby Union, Wales versus South Africa. Now, it was a win for Wales, but by the sounds of it, an even bigger win for player Gethin Jenkins. Gethin Jenkins, quite happy in the receiver position. Bigger, north inside him. <laughs> 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 We're off. North inside him. <laughs> so hello to get, uh, Jenkins and North for their outstanding performance. At the rugby there. <laughs> hello to Lucy who's watching in Colchester, and Ryan in Ipswich, and Cat also in Ipswich. Okay, now over to Sky News for a classic from Eamon Holmes. Sky News, as we all know, is a massive organisation. Reporters all over the world willing to do absolutely anything to get that story. Really? I mean, how long did that go on for? Yeah. It felt, it felt like decades. Yeah. Well, let's go to Tom Rayner. He broke this story for us this morning. He's in a man in Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> classic. It's a classic. Classic, <laughs> A man, of course, the capital of Jordan. I went there once and it was, uh, that was a fun flight. Mm. He's in a man in Jordan. <laughs> yes, we must have said that to each other about 38 times. <laughs> James in Colchester loving the bingo already today. Who's wettest? Um, well, uh, half and half. Really. Half and half. It shows up on this grey suit. Yeah. So yeah. All mine's gathering in the hood. Mm. <laughs> like you do of, of a Friday. <laughs> you and the lads gathering in the hood. <laughs> we do. Down the misty moons. <laughs> Water, please. <laughs> Now we're going to the NFL on Fox in America, and it's the... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what? Sorry, I thought you were doing one. Yeah, I thought you no. were wrong there. <coughs> well, all it's right. It's gone all over Greg's head. <laughs> it's the Washington Redskins versus the Dallas... What's, what's wrong with that? Versus the Dallas Cowboys. I do not understand the rules of American... <laughs> Chris, you sprayed Greg beyond there. <laughs> what did it? What did it? A thought. Oh. Okay. Oh, these are going see-through. Mm. 
NFL Sorry. on Fox, Washington Redskins, Dallas Cowboys. I don't understand the rules. But from now on, I'll be keeping a particular eye on the player Dak Prescott. This time the Redskins put a spy on Dak Prescott. He starts to come and then he pulls out. <laughs> <laughs> He starts to come and then he pulls out. (laughs) 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 Dak Prescott there. Water, please. (laughs) Next. Grand Designs with Kevin McLeod on Channel 4. Now, Kevin sees so many amazing houses, but I can see why this house in particular is in running for House of the Year. I think I need one of these streams at mine. (laughs) What? (laughs) It was just about to happen then. I just caught a glimpse of Scott's cheeky face (laughs) and started laughing. (laughs) Okay. When you do this, you look about ten. <laughs> I really enjoy it. <laughs> you hide behind your hand because you know when it's you know when it's going to happen. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. The stream dictated the engineering, but it also delivers great pleasure downstairs. After all that. The build-up was better. It's, yeah. long, it's a long musical intro. <laughs> what is that which, music? Which was kept in for some reason. <laughs> Water, please. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> and now let's head over to Radio 2 to find out Richard Madeley's weekend plans. I will be spending tomorrow building a brand new barbecue... Having friends over for late afternoon nosh in the garden. <laughs> it's a classic. <laughs> it's a brilliant. It's so brilliant <laughs> because also of the way he says barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to a documentary about the Spanish resort Benidorm on ITV. Now thousands of Brits go to Benidorm every year. Yeah. Water, please. <laughs> <laughs> After hearing this clip, I can understand why. It's not the exercise I'm bothered about. It's just this path. It's so narrow that every time a lorry goes past, you look like you're either going to get sucked off or end up in somebody's bush. (laughs) 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 That's better, Dom. You look like you're either going to get sucked off somebody's bush. Two wonderful outcomes. Mm. <laughs> bush. No, bush. Uh, no wonder so many people go there every year. <laughs> Water, please. Now an absolute classic from Michel Roux's service on BBC Two. Now he really has put a lot of thought into the guest list here. Choosing his guests for their love of one thing and, and one thing only... Gok Wan, Dermot Gavin and Sophie Ellis-Bexter have been personally invited by Michelle for their love of eating out. (laughs) (laughs) Oh my God. That's one of the best of all time. That is one of the best of all time. For their love of eating out. <laughs> what a lineup as uh, well. I know. I know. What an image. I know. And finally, <laughs> because Greg's on, we have to do it. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Come on then. Oh, I've got. Oh, I'll tell you afterwards, but I've got one for you. Okay. You know, for next time. Same okay. bloke. No, no, no. I found no, one the other one. day. Email him. I know. I, t- <laughs> See, I forgot. Mm. <laughs> email him. <laughs> Just send us an email. I will. I will. I will. I will. I will. Mm. Dale, yeah. Dale, yeah. 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 National Lottery, in it to win it. Would anyone accept this as an answer? <laughs> God's sake. <laughs> God's sake, man. <laughs> not even like... <laughs> not even doing some kind of big intro for it. No. It's like a chore. The, uh, the clip speaks for itself. So I'm going to go with head. You're fairly... 
Come on. <laughs> Come on. So I'm going to go with head. You're fairly convinced the answer is head. Yes. Shall I accept head? Yes. <laughs> and that was Greg James. Innuendo bingo. Wow. Dale is the king. He is the king of this game. Well, well done, mate. <laughs> well done, everybody.